Hey guys, Sam here with Friend Adder Elite. I'm about to show you how you can find a date on MySpace, which is the largest social network, which has about 360 million members. I'm going to show you how you can use MySpace Friend Adder Elite to find a date. So, say you were on MySpace and you were looking for someone to date. Uh, let's go through the program uh, through the software so we can show you how to search for a potential date and how you would go about doing it now what's cool about MySpace friend at elite is you have uh, the capability of sending out mass friend requests mass messages and you can send out uh, multiple comments so first let's log into uh, our MySpace account so I'm going to do that right now And if you have multiple accounts on MySpace, you can actually save your accounts as I'm going to do right here. And the software asks me if I want to save this. I click yes. Boom, there it is. My information is saved for me. And I want to log in. And the program will now log me in into MySpace. space is loading up all right so we're gonna put in uh, login and it should be doing that right now files that I set up with MySpace. Okay, so let's get right to it. We're going to go to the gather ID section of the software and we're going to say go to my profile. So I'm already logged in. So let's see what that's saying. Okay, so I'm already logged in. I want to go to gather IDs. Oh, sorry, uh, my profile. So it's going to take me to my my profile page. All right, now I'm at my profile page, and now I want to look for potential uh, females to date. And we're going to go to friends, and we're going to go to browse people. And what's cool about uh, the MySpace friend at Elite, you can toggle the switch button right here. This button will allow you to expand uh, the MySpace browser so you can get a better view of the search features. Alright, so there we have it. Now we're going to browse for women and we're going to say between the ages of 23 and we're going to say 29. Okay, and then we're gonna say single, uh, and we're here and are here for dating. So right there, it tells you that the ones that will come in your search results are here for dating. So you want to pick your area or your country where you want to find your potential uh, date, uh, which is cool. Which is really cool about MySpace because it allows you to do that. Uh, you can search by by country. So let's say uh, we want the United Kingdom. Let's say we're living in the UK and we want to date in the UK. And what's cool about MySpace, you can even narrow it down to zip code. So you know, if you're really particular, if you really want someone kind of your own, in your own neighborhood, uh, you can narrow it down to zip code. So we'll just say the UK for now, and we'll click on update, and we'll see what MySpace brings us. So MySpace came back with 3,000 people that met our criteria, and of course, uh, you know you can even narrow down your criteria even further. Um, and here are some potential uh, females here uh, that uh, we may possibly want to add as friends. So why don't we just say, for demonstration purposes, we want to add. Uh, some of these females here and we want to gather IDs 
Now you have the choice of gathering IDs from the current page or gathering IDs from all pages. So we'll put gather IDs from all pages and we will click on gather IDs. And you can see MySpace Friend Adder Elite is uh, gathering another 40 IDs. And it's going to go through every page gathering IDs uh, to you tell it to stop. So I think we'll stop right there at 120. We'll stop it right there. I think we got the point. So we stopped it right there. Now we want to send a friend request. Now all these IDs here, you see that they're all populated now in this section. And we want to import them to uh, the friend request section because we want to uh, send the friend request. You know, these are potential females that we found and you know, we might uh, want to date them. So let's start off by sending a friend request. So we'll import uh, into the friend request. Now mind you, with this uh, section here, you can send a friend request, a message, or a comment. So you have your choice. But for this demonstration, we're going to send a friend request. So we'll import it, and look at this. All those IDs that we just gathered are now in, are populated here in the friend request section. So we'll just say a brief message. So it's just a general question, just, you know, you know, acknowledging their beauty, and you know, you want to send a friend request. You know, that's how it starts. And we'll click on start, and we'll let MySpace friend Adder Elite get to work. And as you can see here, it's entering the information and it's sending add to friends. Friend request has been sent to this user. Okay, and it's going to keep going. It's going to send one to Mrs. Friend. So you get the idea here. It's gonna keep adding friends that are that you have here all in your your ID. And MySpace Friend Adder Elite will do this for you, all automated, so you don't have to do anything. I think we'll stop it right there. So this process is automated. It'll send all your IDs, uh, your friend request message. Um, so that is a, a, a feature there that you can take advantage of. Now, if you want to send a message and you don't want to send a friend request, you just want to say, hey, hello, um, say you want to send messages to your friends, you click on the tab, you click on messages, Messenger, and you import those same IDs, and uh, those IDs will now fall into the Messenger section uh, of MySpace Friend Adder Elite. And then you just enter in your subject and your message. And like before, you click send. Now, if you come across any captcha, uh, you can ignore the captcha, uh, which is a special feature only on MySpace Friend Adder Elite. So you can ignore captcha uh, if you have a captcha screen. So that's a feature that's only on our software. Okay, so that's pretty much about it for this tutorial on how to find a date on MySpace using MySpace Friend Adder Elite. Uh, you can go to uh, www.friendadderelite.com to get a trial software and try this out for yourself. Um, if you like it, you can purchase it and we have more tutorials that you can use to help you. Um, if you do get stuck, we're always here to help. You can uh, Skype us or you can uh, send us uh, a, a ticket through our help desk and you can find that on our site uh, in the contact us section. Alright, that's about it for now folks. I want to thank you for watching this video and hopefully we'll see you on the other side.